Hey guys, it's Garrett from Garrett Outdoors. It is an absolutely gorgeous day today outside. It's supposed to be up in like 77 degrees, which for the past week it's been pretty chilly. So uh, pretty thankful to have a nice little warm break here and uh, getting ready for the winter, getting windows covered and insulated. And uh, you guys all know I've been working on the firewood. So uh, anyways, you guys, today I'm going to talk to you about a product. Um, I wanted to talk to you about a product I have in my car, part of my car kit. And uh, one of the things I've seen for a long time, I wanted for a long time, um, I didn't get it until just this year. I've had it for a little while now though, so I've gotten to use it and try different things out with it and see what I like with it. And uh, anyways, you guys, it is the Zulu Nylon Gear Molly Webbed Sun Visor. Um, panel I guess you would call it for uh, as you, the sun visor and um, it allows you to keep gear real close by all right you guys so stick around and check it out all right you guys as you can see it in its currently equipped form this thing can hold quite a bit of gear I got the electric glow stick. I got a flashlight, swivel head on it. We got a snap light glow stick. We got the SC Azula. Have a little ferro rod in here. We got one of those tiny little Molly knives. Got a Bic lighter. Couple good pens and then one of these lights that expands and has the angleable head light and it has a um, magnet here on the bottom in case I was to drop keys or something else metal into a grate or something I need to try to reach to get it out. So that's how I have it currently equipped. This isn't my normal loadout. I'm trying a few new things but I figured while I had it off I'd shoot the video and show you guys what I've been working with here. And then on the other side, uh, cat hair is getting all over it. We have a uh, deep pocket. You can keep anything in these pockets really. Uh, I tend to keep my insurance information and other things like that. I got a, another good pen here that I like to keep tucked in like this. I also have more of these elastic bands like they have on the sides here, uh, which I haven't really used for anything yet. I haven't decided what I wanted to put there or if I even need to put anything there. And then as you can see, it's held on by these three Velcro straps. So you stick it on the visor, flip these over it, and then close it. And uh, I tell you what, that holds it extremely secure. It has not come loose, not even a little, at all since I've had it and all the different ways I've loaded it out. And then the Molly itself, the bottom ones here, they're elastic, and the top ones are elastic. The center one is not. So for things uh, that are kind of harder to put in, like maybe the big lighter and these flashlights. It works really well on the elastic molly, on the elastic webbing. And then the, the knife here, things that you need it to hold really tight so that you can pull things out, it holds pretty good there. Now, I gotta admit this is a little loose. Uh, if I really wanted to tighten it, I could use the attachment points probably to uh, really anchor it there but I like the fact that I can easily remove it on and off if I want to. It is very dependable. It's very sturdy. The webbing is all looks like uh, at least double stitched on the elastic bands and then the normal one actually looks to be triple or quadruple stitched so you know it's not going to come apart. Let's see if I can give you a close-up on that. Look at that. See, that's, that's at least double stitched. And then down here, these look like they're triple or quadruple stitched. I can't really tell. Pretty good. So that's pretty good right there. The Velcro straps are on there pretty tight too, so this thing's not going to fall apart on you. So definitely a good, good buy in my opinion. Definitely a good way to have... Uh, a lot of gear, readily accessible. I know I want to put something in there like a seatbelt cutter, um, which I actually had gotten a seatbelt cutter and window breaker thing, but uh, I didn't like it. I was going to do a review on it, and I started to look at it and mess with it, and 
Didn't like it. So I got to find something else. But anyways, you guys, that is it for today's video. I once again really appreciate you guys joining me today here on my channel. I appreciate everything you guys do. All the comments, questions, suggestions, the likes, the shares, thumbs up, all that. I really appreciate it. And if you do have any comments, questions, or suggestions, make sure you put that down in the comment box below, and I will catch you guys next time.